How's it going everyone? How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Josh K, the Lonely Hermit. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we're getting into week four of the Elite Battle League. Today, we are taking on the Texas Tyranitar. Their coach is the Doorman. His link is going to be down below. Go check him out. Go subscribe so you can see his point of view of the match. He's a fantastic content creator, so you definitely want to go check out his content. While you're down there, check out all the other coaches in the Elite Battle League as well. Subscribe to them so you do not miss any of the other matches in the Elite Battle League. Week 4 is tuning up to be quite the uh, quite the showdown between a few teams. Um, so, this is going to be a, 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 an interesting match because in my practice battles, my team was doing quite well against the Doormans. Um, there are a couple Pokemon I don't want to see. If he doesn't bring them, it's better for me. Um... Jirachi and Claydol, they weren't really a problem. They just were a nuisance um, They just prolonged the battle a little bit longer than maybe it should have uh, been um, So there's a two Pokemon if I don't see them I'm happy if I see them I have things to deal with them. So it's not that big of an issue um, So yeah, there's that um, So I, I'm pretty I'm pretty happy with what my team is right now um, And hopefully hopefully fingers crossed we can walk away with a win in this one. I feel good uh, I feel good about this one. Um, Doorman's gonna do his intro and then he's gonna put in his code. So um, before I, you know, pause and wait until we get into the match, while you're down there as well, check out the playlist links for the series we got going on with Fire Leaf Green, Three Red versus Black Red versus With Inferno Man. Uh, my white type block just wrapped up or will wrap up tomorrow. Uh, this is coming out on Saturday, not Sunday. Um, we'll wrap up tomorrow, so we'll have another series coming your way as well. Um, so check that out. And uh, check out my Twitter, Instagram, Twitch. Go follow and subscribe where it's necessary. It's all greatly appreciated. And again, check out all the other coaches. Subscribe to their channels and all that good stuff. So I will catch you guys when we get nicely connected to the, to the doorman. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have our opponents here, the doorman. Um, I'm going to go ahead and decide the rules. Think about all normal rules. Yes. All right, here is our team. Um, music doesn't matter because you guys aren't going to hear it. Not Lugi, not Boob, not Humby, La Puerta. Uh, or Ali, uh, what is it? El Hombre de Puerta. Um, this is the team we're rocking with. Leafeon, Primarina, Excadrill, Thunderous, Drapion, and Mewtwo. God, I hope the Pokemon are right. <laughs> so this is the team we're rocking with for this battle. Um, and yeah, so I'm very curious as to what his team is going to be. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So I can write them down. Uh, Torkoal, he didn't bring Jirachi. Okay. Uh, Torkoal, Agron, Rayquaza, 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 Sceptile, Walrein, and Claydol. They didn't bring... He didn't bring... Oh, what did I just do? Oh, he, uh, <laughs> that was scared me for a second. He didn't bring uh, Jirachi. That's that's good for us. I wonder why. I'm curious as to the reason why. I I think he leads Claydol or Agron or maybe even Torkoal. I think the three he doesn't lead are the ones in the middle. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> what does he lead with? I'm gonna turn on the music in my earbuds, my headphones. What does he lead with? I need to know nicknames too, so I'm gonna write that down. Dino. Dino is Sceptile? Oh, no, no. Oh, did the I run. This thing probably stealth rocks right away, so we're gonna taunt. We're gonna taunt. We outspeed it, guaranteed. I wonder if it has Earthquake. Probably, huh? Yep. Perfect. Now we, uh, we Swords Dance. Probably switches here to Claydol. I could see that. If he switches to Claydol, I know he has a ground type move. Because I don't, I mean, yeah, I don't really see reason because I am a dark type. He might not have Earthquake. That could play in our favor. Or maybe this Aggron doesn't have any attacking moves. So this is one of our best leads was Scrapion. I practice with Lion Heart plays. Um, I came up with this plan. He helped me fine tune it. That's normally our uh, 
our agreement. <laughs> I come up with the plan, he fine tunes it. Earthquake, yep. That shouldn't kill. Yeah. But, 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 we get rid of the sturdy on this thing, which is exactly what I want. Hit me again, buddy. Hit me again. It's okay. It's okay. Drapion's not here to sweep. Drapion's not here to sweep. If it goes down, that's fine. It's not here to sweep. It's not here to sweep. If he switches to Rayquaza, that's a good plan on his part. If he switches to Rayquaza, that's a good plan on his part. I would just go for the kill. Is I mean, unless this thing doesn't have sturdy. If this thing doesn't have sturdy, that's big for us. It does have sturdy. Okay, cool. So I'm assuming he's gonna Iron Head. That should kill. Yeah. Okay. Agron. Iron Head. That's fine. So now what we do is we go to Moros. We go to Moros. We nasty. I know I can take one hit. Does it shake the taunt? No. Does it? Not that. Oh no, it's not taunted anymore. Not at all. Probably tries a stealth rock here. Or he tries to attack. Let me see. Let's see. If you we live a hit. I know we live a hit. He's stealth rock, perfect. So I know we'll take another hit, so I'm gonna nasty pot again. I'm gonna ask the pot again. I know we take a hit. I'm gonna ask the pot again. Yep, he didn't Dynamax either. So. I think I'm 99% I'm sure we take one hit from this thing. Please, don't curve. Oh yeah, dude. We sweep. Um, I'm not gonna Dynamax just yet. I couldn't ask Paul one more time, but there's no need. From my calculations, I believe plus four, the only Pokemon that could take a hit was, uh, what you called? Um, Jirachi. That's why I didn't really want it to come. So we saved, we saved the Dynamax. There's no need to Dynamax on a, on a, uh, Agron when that's at low health. We do outspeed his whole team as well. If I, if I built this thing correctly, it should be, uh, in speed. So we should outspeed this whole team, including Septo. I think we got this, guys. At the very least, Mitsu's getting a lot of kills here. <laughs> I feel like. I, I wonder if he has anything though for this, potentially. Mewtwo, uh, for us. Septo, Septo. Yep. So we Dynamax. Um, what benefits me more here? I don't want to take chip damage, so we'll just do this. We outspeed. It should kill. <laughs> I think even if he's Dynamax, it should kill. Should kill. And we get a lot of health back, too. We get a lot of health back. We get like 120 health. He Dynamaxes as well. I don't think it matters. Septile's special defense is not great. Dude, I'm freaking shaking right now. I can't even hold my mouth straight. <laughs> Septile. Yeah, it's Spadef isn't... It's not terrible, but it's not... I don't think it's enough to take something from this Mewtwo. Let's see. If this kills, we, we sweep for sure. Yep. GG's. Max Flare, that's all. Nothing outspeeds me, man. We one-shot everything. <laughs> it works. Oh, it worked, dude. The plan worked. That was the plan all along. Let Drapion go down. Um, and then see if I could set up with Mewtwo. I had, like, honestly, Drapion was just in there to, to kind of... It was in there to get rid of Claydol and get rid of Sturdy. And potentially get rid of Jirachi, or at least do damage to Jirachi. That's all Drapion was meant to do. It got rid of Aggron Sturdy and it died. I was perfectly okay with that. It did exactly what it needed to do because it allowed me to get into a position to set up with me too. So, 
It all worked out. Uh, I don't know what else he could have. TBH. To try and take me out. I'm trying to think. I have Ice Beam for Claydol and Rayquaza. Honestly, send in Torkoal and protect. Statue. That's uh, clear. We have Max Hailstorm for that. Should kill. Yep. Max Hailstorm. Play I'm like. It was just a really bad matchup for the doorman. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I came up with this team right away, and I won every single practice battle pretty decisively. So, I, I think it's just a really bad team matchup, to be honest. It is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Sends out Solar, which is horrible. Um, I think a Max Knuckles should kill. Yeah, I mean, it's the only non, not very effective movie yet, so. I think it should kill, though. I mean, to, to be fair, that Torkoal is very good, so. Yep. Mewtwo is a menace. <laughs> Max Knuckle. And we go back to normal, but it doesn't really make a difference. We just lose health, really. I Ice Beam, Rayquaza, I Aorus for your Walrein. Tusk. Walrein. His best bet might have been to Dynamax either Torkoal or Walrein instead of Sceptile, to be honest. I think he might have underestimated the power of me too. <laughs> it should kill. Walrein's bulky though, so I wouldn't be surprised if it would. Me too. For us here. And then we Ice Beam and Rayquaza dies. Rayquaza does not take an Ice Beam. <laughs> it does not take an Ice Beam. Ice Beam. Rayquaza. That definitely kills. <laughs> Oh man, all right, cool. Jeez, we improve. Woo! Yes, me too, yes. We improved to three and one. That is three straight wins for us. GG's Zorban. Let's go, me too. Big dubs, big dubs. Oh man, I was my heart was pounding. I was afraid that the plan wasn't gonna work, but it actually worked exactly. That's pretty much identical to how a lot of practice battles went. Um, so that was incredible. GG's Zorban. Um, honestly, Dynamax and Sceptile might not have been your best play. Maybe Torkoal or Walrein even. Um, but by that point, I was already plus four, so it was kind of too late, to be honest. Um, so yeah, GG's. Like I said, we improved to three and one. I'm not sure if that takes us top of our conference. It, it gets us damn near close, I think. Um, so, uh, um... It gets us very, very close. We should hopefully get MVP this week. This is our best chance. I mean, we, Drapion is the only Pokemon that died. Um, so hopefully we can walk away with an MVP this week. But uh, GG Zorman, check his, his uh, channel down below. Go subscribe if you do not miss uh, his side of the, of the match. Um, also subscribe to all the other coaches in the Elite Battle League. So you do not miss any of the matches this week. And uh, yeah, check all the good stuff down below. Follow and subscribe where it's necessary. And of course, be sure to share socials with all your friends, family, everyone. You know, let people know only here it's where it's at. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.